Good afternoon, everyone. Our next speaker for keynote number five presentation is Xiang Xie, co-founder of Primus, and he'll be presenting us unlocking data interoperability for blockchain and AI. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you for the for the introduction. So yeah, thank you guys for staying here. So I'm gonna make it fast. So I know he's kind of tired. And so it's, it's about the primers. It's about how to unlock data interoperability for blockchain and AI. So yeah, we know that uh, agent is taking over the world. And, uh, and for now we're working on this kind of single agent like posting Twitter, you know, posting transactions. And um, we can envision that in the future, that kind of agent network. That means that uh, each one, each person gonna have a like digital copy, and they want to communicate with each other. So then, kind of agent network that you have to, you know, exchange information, data, or you know, make decisions within each other. So it's kind of from single agent to you know multiple uh, agent network. So, but. Yeah, it's kind of fantastic, but we still have. We still think that there is kind of you know uh, challenges for this kind of agent or the agent network or AI network. So there's a few steps like data accessibility means that uh, we kind of running out of public data for AI agent or for, uh, for AI. So it's it's very hard for them to access to you know very personal data. It's not to be sensitive, but it's kind of personal. So. Uh, we have to figure a way that figure out a way that we can enable our agent to uh, access like voice fiber data for them to get more you know precise decisions with that. So it's all about like authenticity and it's about that uh, how to keep the activities uh, you know of the agent to be like autonomous. And uh, this means that uh, you have to make sure that it's, it's a real AI, it's a real like agent. It's not someone behind the 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 the, the, the you know. Behind that, and you start just type everything that answers all the questions. So the other thing that's about privacy, you know, when we go to you know, customized applications, especially related to you know, uh, one person, or there is kind of privacy issues that we do not want to outsource our data to this agent. So we have to provide this privacy preserving way for a lot of applications. And the the, the most important thing that I think we should provide a. Uh, a uh, robust way for collaboration between agents, which means that you have to make sure that all the data, all the activities can be verifiable between each other, then you can make the correct decision. So that's that's uh, how uh, that's how uh, a primer wants to solve. So we think that there is kind of missing layer, so between blockchains and the uh, application layer. So I know there's a lot of blockchains, a lot of like L1, L2s, and there's a lot of applications. So, but but still, like there is a missing you know connection between these kind of two layers to you know to bring real data to bring real uh, uh, you know uh, capabilities to support these kind of uh, 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 use, use cases. So uh, what we trying to do is to build this kind of you know layer to bring web two data web data to any kind of ecosystem. We don't care about any uh, very specific uh, chains and applications, including AI, and also. Uh, we are not a chain. Uh, we do not want to build a chain. We kind of a uh, service layer that we can provide this uh, very easy to use APIs, SDKs, or any other thing that can help you to you to uh, integrate between the blockchain systems and the applications to make it scalable. And uh, yeah, we kind of bring this kind of uh, uh, build this kind of uh, uh, data infra for future engine, uh, uh, agent network. So. There's two things we are now focusing focus. So the first thing that we want to make sure that all the data between these kind of applications or blockchains to be verifiable. You can verify that the data is actually from some source you trust, and uh, you can you can you can uh, make sure that the data you output is verifiable. And the other part is about computation. So uh, data alone is not enough. You have to use it. Means that you have to compute it. And in this case. Uh, Maybe privacy is a problem, so we have to provide this kind of uh, privacy-preserving way, privacy-preserving computation for all these kinds of agents and applications of Web3. This is what uh, what we're building. 
So the yeah, it's about tech. Yeah, uh, that core technology we are now using is you know uh, ZigTLS and the FHE. So it's kind of uh, a little bit tech. So ZigTLS means that enable anyone to prove any Web2 data that is actually from some source. So we actually bridge the Web2 world and the Web3 world in a verifiable way without the trust, and it's, tr it's, it's truly permissionless. And it's, it's about new algorithms about that. And the other part is about the computation. So we can do you know, operations on Scythe test without exposing any kind of information to the operator. So we kind of uh, you know, uh, uh, combine these two things together to build our you know, uh, entire data infra for the whole system. And uh, yeah, we are kind of a very cryptography heavy company and uh, we design algorithms and uh, make it fast. So for ZKTLS, we kind of, yeah, 10 times faster than existing solutions. And for the KFH stuffs, we kind of make it more than 400 times to make it practical. And this is what this is the, the architecture of 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 the uh, of premise network. So basically, we're gonna use the blockchain. We're gonna use the uh, storage. We're gonna use the uh, incentive blockchains to for the users to you know build uh, applications related to data, related to uh, uh, agent. And uh, this the, the the thing that we are now provide is about the SDKs or APIs of the KTLS and the KFH stuffs for them to verify the data computer data and support all these kind of data driven applications or AI driven applications. Uh, there's few uh, showcases. Uh, we're now uh, uh, working with uh, working with like Fala. We put our like the Gitele server to to the uh, uh, Fala TE that we can make sure that everything is verifiable and that there's no uh, 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 risk uh, in the in the testers side and that we can make sure that all these kind of uh, uh, data that the kind of proof is uh, is actually verifiable, and also we are now um, we actually contribute to the uh, Eliza uh, 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 framework, and uh, it is already in it. It's kind of promise plugin that we can use ZKTLS to prove all the activities of agents, like uh, the inference of the large language model. They're like. Uh, we call it the brain. The, the, the brain, the, the, the large language model is actually the brain of the agent. And uh, any other kind of actions, like they can post a transaction, they can post a reader, and others that they can get information from outside. So all these kind of activities is verifiable. It means that it's true, uh, it's truly done by the agent. And it even can be verifiable on, uh, in, in a small contract. This is uh, super interesting that we are now working with like agent or AI related uh, uh, companies that we can make sure that everything is verifiable. It's not kind of some human behind that. So yeah, we also have a, a tons of applications with a lot of partners there. So like uh, 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 we can onboarding new help the pro uh, help the programs to onboarding new Web2 users for them. And we kind of, um, uh, to provide these on-off wrapping systems. So there's a lot, especially for DKTLS, and we're gonna promote our products to the uh, industry to you know to help them to onboard more users and even make a revenue. So this kind of uh, uh, the, the the future we're gonna do is about uh, like verifiable AI or you know on-chain confidentiality. I think it's especially when we reach out to enterprise level solutions, it's gonna be very important for privacy issues. Uh, 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 with, with this home of emission uh, uh, solutions. Yeah, the, the, about our team is kind of uh, very, very uh, cryptography heavy, and uh, Shaw is our crypto uh, chief cryptographer, and uh, yeah, Vicky is our SMO. So uh, some highlights: we are very actively in the industry, and we especially we kind of contribute to the Ether Foundation to help them to build, you know, very fast libraries to improve their algorithms. So we are uh, very open to this area. And also, we got very uh, fantastic investors like uh, this person, Symbolic of Egg, to help us to promote the, the the industry. So yeah, that's pretty much it. And uh, uh, let's keep uh, let's keep in touch if you want to uh, know more about us. Thank you so much.